Stop being ridiculous, okay? You're not gonna lose me. Okay, look. If there's any alcohol at the party, then we'll leave, okay? I can't let you take that chance. Gosh, if you can't trust me to say and do what I, I just told you I'm gonna do, then you need to find a new best friend, okay? Okay, I guess I will. Stop it, Sarah. Stop it. Why are you so... Fine. Fine. I won't be needing this anymore, okay? You know, some people say that a dream is just your mind trying to make sense of what you experience during the day, or that a dream can be trying to show you something important or something you need to change. Looking back on it now, I think they may be right. I've lived here all my life, gone to the same school, had the same best friend. It's all been the same my whole life, and for the past 10 years, I've shared everything with my best friend, Sarah. Our homework, our food, our thoughts, our fondest memories, and even our deepest fears. But all that seemed to change when Michael showed up. Don't get me wrong, Michael's a great guy, but it seemed like for the past few months, all that she wanted to talk about was him. Hey! Hey, guys. We're gonna go see a movie today after school. Why don't you come with us? I don't know what's playing. Well, we don't know. We're just gonna go at half time. Yeah. I don't know, guys. I have a lot of homework. Oh, come on. You can blow it off. It's the weekend. Please. I really want to see you tonight. Come on. Well, I guess. But we're just going to the movie after that. I'm going straight home. Yes, sir. Captain, homework. Oh, my gosh. Okay. See you later, Michael. I'm in a hurry, too. So you wanted to see me today after school in the courtyard, right? Okay. okay well, then I'm going to go. Hey, I need to talk to you about something later. It's important. But it can wait, right? Yeah. Bye. You should cherish every moment of your high school years. And by that I mean you've made friends, you've, you've uh, developed relationships. Uh, won't be too long until you're out in the real world dealing with real circumstances and all the friends and relationships that you've made up to now could be gone like that. Okay guys, assignment. Yeah. Don't forget you have an essay due. The next time you come into class I want the pre-write, the first draft, the final draft and it will be due by the end of the block. 
Questions? Oh, by the way, have a great four-day weekend. These last two years have been a constant storm in my life. Last year, my grandfather was diagnosed with cancer and was given only nine months to live. He lived for only three weeks after that. Then, on my parents' 15th anniversary, they went out to celebrate. They were hit by a drunk driver, and they were both killed instantly. Since then, I've been living with my grandmother. I don't know how she holds it together. Hey! Hey, you were in the courtyard today after school. Yeah, I decided to skip out early. What were you going to tell me? Sir, I don't want you to think I'm crazy or anything. You know, like a weirdo, but... You? No way, Kate. Um, well... I... Oh, don't play that game. I know you tell me everything. Just do it. Alright then. I had this dream where I saw you in a car. What's so significant about that? Let me finish, Sarah. I saw you in this car and you were... Oh, oh, just a second. I have another call, okay? Hey? Yeah? Huh. Well, I, I don't know how she'd feel about that, but let me ask her, okay? Just a second. Kate? Okay, we're not going to go to the movie anymore. We are wanting to go to Todd's party. Yeah, is that okay with you? Sure, why not? Hey, Sarah? can't go to that party. What? Why? Because I said we just can't, okay? Why not? You just wouldn't understand. <sighs> yeah, Mike. I don't know what's up here. I'm gonna talk to you later, okay? I've gotta get this straightened out. <sighs> yeah, okay. Bye. What's gotten you so bossy lately? If you've gone through what I've just gone through, then you'd be doing the same thing, okay? Well, maybe you're right. Maybe I don't know what's up with you these days. No, I didn't mean it that way. Okay, stop. You need to decide what you do mean. We just can't go to the party. A party? Yeah. We argued about it, and she just kept getting more and more angry, and now I don't think she's willing to talk to me. Tonight? Yeah, at Todd's house. Oh, I see. What do you think I should do, Grandma? I think if I were you, I would call Sarah just as soon as you can and try to make up with her. Yeah, you're right, Grandma. That is the right thing to do. Hello, this is Kate. Is Sarah there? She's already left for the party. I see. Well, thank you. Bye. Have you two made up yet? No, not yet. Sarah's mom said she just left for the party. Oh, I see. Wait, I'll call Sarah's cell phone. Hello, Sarah. Wait. Hi, Mike. Is Sarah around? You guys are still at your house? Well, could you guys stay there for a few minutes? I need to talk to Sarah. It's really important. Is everything all right? Yes, but I have to go over to Sarah's now.
Hey, Kate, okay. we're just off to the party. No! What? I can't let you guys go to that party. Why not? Because I had a dream. I found you dead, Sarah. Kate, okay, if it's about me dating your best friend, I understand. It has nothing to do with that. Then what is it? I've just lost a lot of people in my life. I don't want to lose you, too. Okay, look. If there's any alcohol at the party, then we'll leave, okay? I can't let you take that chance. Gosh, if you can't trust me to say and do what I, I just told you I'm gonna do, then you need to find a new best friend, okay? Okay, I guess I will. You know what? I don't want your necklace anymore. I really don't. I'm totally serious here. I don't ever want to see you again. It's a shame that someone had to die in order for the rest of us to value our lives more. Looking back, I don't know if there was anything I could have said to stop her from getting in that car. But still, I don't think I tried hard enough. I know I told you that if there's any drinking at the party, that we'd leave. But you gotta understand, when I get in those kinds of situations, I just don't think. That's right, Mike. You were thinking. I'm sorry I pushed you, okay? How many times do I have to say it? <laughs> you don't get it, Mike! You're right, I don't get it. What can I do to make it up? Sarah, come on. Sarah, come on. I forgive you. Alright, that's the Sarah I know. Now, I know you've done a fantastic job of driving, but it's my car and I think I should be driving. Mike! Come on. You're tired, you don't like to drive. Don't mind, I'm okay. Do you promise never to drink again? Cross my heart and hope to die. 